Hey everyone, how's it going? Uh, in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, maintain on-speed AOA uh, which is essential for landing in the Hornet especially if you want to land on the carrier and uh, it's pretty straightforward um, there's nothing nothing magic about it but um, I've got a camera set up so you can see what I'm doing with my controls um, and you'll see that actually there's barely any input involved whatsoever to get uh, your AOA correct. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to turn this jet around <coughs> and start coming on the down downwind lead, leg as if I was going to land. So let's just extend a little bit. Just reduce the throttle slightly. Right, okay, so what we're going to do is we're just going to level out and we're going to get the uh, TVV, this guy in the middle, on the horizon line. And then we're just going to bring the throttle back to idle. And that's it. Okay, just have to wait. You could use the speed brakes, but in this case we won't. And when the speed drops to below 280 knots, we'll drop our landing gear and our flaps to full. Okay, so keep the TVV in the center with tiny inputs. And then as soon as the E bracket starts to drop, which it will do in a second, it's raising a moment because our flaps are down. Okay, it's going to drop and drop and drop and drop. And all we do is just add trim, add trim and then push on the power slightly and keep adding trim until the TVV is in the center of the E-bracket. So I've added, added a little bit of power, bit more trim, bit more trim and there we go. And you can see that it's completely stable. I can actually start turning the jet and it will remain on speed and all you need to do to adjust your pitch is the throttle we're not touching the stick whatsoever just adjust slightly to adjust our bank but that's about it so we're raising again so because you've added throttle our nose is coming up so let's reduce a bit to re retain it on the uh, horizon line and where's our landing zone over there, our airfield. So we're just adjusting the bank with the stick. We're not adding any pitch inputs whatsoever. So I'm just going to reduce the throttle, throttle now so the uh, TVV drops. So I'm going to have no pitch inputs at all. It's completely stable, hands off. All right, I'm just gonna line up with the runway now. There's no wind in this mission, but um, if there was a bit of wind, you'd have to make some adjustments for the crosswind, but that's about it. So again, no pitch inputs whatsoever. I'm not even going to flare. I'm just going to let the, la the jet just drop itself onto the runway. I mean, the Hornet can withstand this. So I mean, it's only 600 feet per second, per minute, sorry. And... It's even wanting to take off again. There we go. And that's it. Simple as. It will make your landings a lot easier. 
so I hope you enjoyed this video uh, if you like the video please leave a comment and yeah I'll be making more videos in the future so see you soon bye